over 13, 14, and 15 because you mentioned you were confused in that last section. Uh, one thing you have to keep in mind is if they're asking for cosine, they want the x value. If they're asking for sine, they want the y value. And if they're asking for tangent, then they want the y over x value. So make sure you jot that down. You, it's absolutely necessary you need a filled in unit circle in front of you to do this section. So number 13, they're asking for sine of 5 pi over 4. You're going to look for 5 pi over 4 on the unit circle. Found it. And then since they want the sine value, they just want the y value. So this part of the coordinate, negative radical 2 over 2. So that's your solution for number 13. Tangent at 60, we're going to go to 60. We want the y value divided by the x value. So radical 3 over 2 over 1 half. Now that's a little bit harder. When you're dividing fractions, um, you need to multiply by the reciprocal. Like that, cancel. So it's going to be radical 3. That's the answer to number 14. And finally, number 15, cosine 3 pi over 2. I'm going to look for 3 pi over 2. Found it. And they want the cosine, which is the x value. So just the first part of the coordinate, 0. So there's your answer to 13, 14, and 15. And hopefully you understand how to do that, that section of the homework a little better. Bye.